Yo, what's up guys, my name is Mr. Freeze 2244 and welcome to uh, There Was A Firefight Challenge in Berlin and this involves dressing up as the, the club owner and uh, doing some other stuff. So what we need to do is uh, we're just going to bring all the default equipment but before I start there, I just want to say thank you to Square Enix and IO Interactive for giving me free early access to the game. I really do appreciate it. If you've missed any videos that I've covered so far for Berlin, there's a link in the description of the full playlist of challenges. There will also be a link at the end of the video as well itself. Like I said, you need to start at the club entrance. That will be unlocked at Mastery Level 3. If you don't start in this location, you just start at the bus station. Uh, sorry, the bus stop. Then you're going to be too far away and you're not going to be able to see all the targets. So, I recommend just unlocking this location. It's really quick and easy to get to anyway. But from the start, we're going to have to get through the Frisk Zone itself. And what we need to do is get down to the club level itself. We need to get down there and get access to the restricted area. And we're going to do some, some sneaky, sneaky stuff to get in there. And we'll need to take out the club owner and become the club owner himself. I, there is another challenge by just dressing up as him, but I just don't remember what it's called. That's why I didn't include it in the title of this video. But uh, yeah, you'll get that challenge completed as well if you haven't done it already. So what we've got to do is disguise yourself as the club owner. One thing I haven't tried yet is he drops uh, like some uh, phone numbers on the floor. I'm not sure if you can actually complete this challenge without even dressing up as a club owner. I haven't tried it, but uh, I'm curious to know. But where we uh, actually we need to go is behind the, uh, the DJ set. So to go into this tech-only area, this door should be unlocked. And we need to climb up these ladders. Because if you go around through the doors, which are key, ca key uh, card locked anyway, there's going to be two guards blocking the, uh, the club owner's office. So we're just going to jump over the top of these vents. And we're going to get behind these two bikers. Just go ahead and drop down. Just don't drop down too closely, otherwise you might closely get spotted like that. Let me grab that key card there, even though we don't need it. But to distract the club owner himself when you're in here, just turn on this gramophone. You might recognize the music from Haven Island. But when you've got his attention, just go ahead and turn that off. There we go. And I like that uh, it only distracts the targets when it comes to this sort of thing because it could very easily have distracted just one of the guards so I'm pretty sure they've changed that from Hit uh, in Hitman 3 because I don't think that was a thing in Hitman 2 I think uh, only the uh, whoever was closest goes to investigate the distraction but now the right person does so I'm glad that's that's uh, a thing now also I don't know the code to that safe I don't know where to get it from uh, I would love to know but once you put this disguise on after you've taken out this club owner you, you will get a challenge there I just don't know what it's called, I can't remember. Once you grab those phone numbers on the floor, you just want to it's use this answer machine. Given it some Let's talk. That's going to lure five targets into this room okay. and give you a perfect opportunity to take them all out. Now you know what to do. But yeah, with that safe, I don't know what the code is yet. So we're going to go ahead and sit down, otherwise you'll it will become a trespassing area for some reason, or... A, Hostile area, I should say. Because these know that you're 47. Now let's talk a firefight is about to go down. That's how you unlock the challenge. So you can skip this conversation if you want to. It's going to end in a firefight either way. But uh, whenever you're ready, you may as well wait for all the targets to come in into the room because all five of them will come in here and they'll stand around you. Just do what we're told. Just waiting for a couple of more people. Being compromised. It's not part of their business plan. <sighs> well, anyway, it is truly an honor to finally meet you. Okay, that's enough talk. And don't take this personally. I have to admit, though, it's an even greater honor to be the one who took out the legendary 47. Because now so it's just time one to more. Die. As soon as he enters the room, he's going to kick that table, flip it over there, grab the gun, and go ham. It's brilliant. I love the combat in this game. It's going to attract a lot of attention because you're using an, uh, a sword off shotgun. So I, that's understandable. So just going to clean house. 
could literally combine this challenge with the T47 challenge. If you shotgun all these targets, grab the spiker disguise and uh, take the motorcycle exit, you can complete the T47 challenge. I've only just thought of that, actually. Um, I don't know, I might still might do a separate video to make it a bit more stealthy, but... I just love the uh, the end... Look at this room. Like, it's just like a perfect, like, scene of a firefight. It's just... I love it. Anyway, that's how you complete the challenge of There Was A Firefight Challenge. So that's going to do it for this video as well. So thank you very much for watching. Feel free to drop a like on this video if it helped you out. And subscribe if you are brand new to the channel. And hit the bell notification to be notified of all future videos and live streams. And consider supporting me on Patreon or even becoming a member of the channel by clicking the join button below or clicking the link in the description. Big shout out to my Psycho Assassin members, Paul Lilly, Big D, Bedry and Bryant. I really do appreciate your Psycho Assassin memberships. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. If you've missed any videos I've covered so far in Berlin, there's a link in the description. And I'll, uh, yeah, see you later. Cheers.